All right guys, so at your request, I am doing the unbagging real quick before I get the other video where I actually went to uh, UFO Every Day, which is the uh, crane place that has the most amount of cranes in it in Japan. So most of this is going to be smaller, plushy prizes and stuff. Uh, that's because a lot of their better machines was actually the small machines, so uh, let's just get right into it. What I'm going to do is I'm just going to toss this right on up here and we'll... Uh, just kind of unload as we go. I won a lot of small prizes, but uh, most of it's just that way because their claws were actually fairly strong and fair. Uh, their bigger claws were actually more of a problem. So let's get this big one out of the way. Uh, this is, I believe, a Conti Collection uh, Nesso Berry. Uh, nope, it is, uh, is the Order of the Rabbit. Uh, Nesso Berry. I got this out of one of the big Kleina Flex uh, cranes. I'll make sure to upload that video. But basically it's your normal claws, but super huge. Uh, we got a Jinbei. Uh, pink shark, whale shark. So I got a couple of these. I got the pink one. Uh, there's another one in here. Uh, I got a Pikachu holding a Thunderstone. And there should also be in his Evolution Raichu in here somewhere. I got a Growlithe. A little Growlithe. I actually managed to win a full set of these little guys. I got the Pichu Growlithe. Um, here's the Raichu. Put you right there. Put you guys there for now. And uh, a tiny little loppy. It's the newer loppies that were just put out not that long ago. The monochrome with the bows. So we'll put you there. We've got a little Hello Kitty holding a letter. Uh, it looks like a love letter uh, in a pink Sailor Scout outfit. that with Loppy. Uh, I got a little penguin. Plushy. Um, this one will be a very interesting video. I think you guys will find entertaining. So I got a Dragon Ball plush squish. So and it's I won the four and the one star balls. We'll put those over here. Um, another of the Hello Kitty with a love letter in a blue sailor outfit. Uh, for those of you who don't know, middle schools and high schools uh, typically have this as a uniform item, but the skirts aren't quite this style. That being said, uh, the actual rest of it is fairly normal for Japan. I got one of the uh, cute little jellyfish things. I actually think I have a customer specifically in mind for this one. Uh, it's real soft, beanbag at the bottom. You can hear it. That way it sits upright. I tried to win more of these, but I had to get them to put them out, so it was kind of a putz. Uh, we won a little Nesso Berry. I am not sure what she's from, but I want to say it's the Derby Girls. So if anyone knows for sure, let me know in the uh, comments below. We'll put you there. Uh, here's the Vulpix to go with the Pichu and Growlithe. And the Meowth that also goes with them. And someone is trying to talk to me, or my phone is. I also got one of the white bunnies. The white loppies, so we'll put that one there. Now these were something I won just for myself for the most part, but 
they were a total pain in the butt to win. They're super soft. And the real problem was, is it was basically just a table machine with a chute at the front and you just had to get them pushed towards the front, which sounds really easy, but because of their shape, they were basically spinning on the axis of right around their neck. So if I grabbed it from the butt or from the head, it spun. And if I grabbed it from the neck, it either would roll over or it wouldn't really go where I wanted to. Uh, pushing on it actually usually ended up resulting in it going back further in the machine. I'm contemplating whether or not to upload that. If you guys want to see a fail video, <laughs> uh, maybe that. Uh, one of them was easy to get. The, this one was the hardest one to get though. But I got orange. Pink. And blue. And the blue one has red eyes. Um, this will be a very good win for you guys to watch. Um, this is from a Jonkin Po machine. Jonkin is basically rock, paper, scissors, for those of you who don't know. And uh, basically you had to beat it two out of three times, so it wasn't too bad, but it wasn't easy either. Um, there were some varying factors towards the end that made it a little bit more difficult. Here is the other Jinbei whale shark, a nice little rainbow um, one. Put you there. Um, I also managed to win a scrump from Lilo and Stitch Nessoberry plush. Pretty soft. It's not mink soft, but it is pretty soft. Um, I'd say about the same style as the Pokemon, maybe a little bit softer. So, Lilo and Stitch Scrump. Let's move the bag out of the way here. I also won, I think this is the last big prize I won, is uh, Slink. So we've got Slink here from Toy Story. I actually feel like I'm missing something, but I'll have to double check and check my backpack and look around. But overall, not too bad. I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24 prizes from my visit there. Um, I will be announcing if any of these end up being a giveaway item or anything along those lines. Um, I actually will probably include something in the uh, May giveaway. Um, stay tuned for the announcement for the winner for that. And I'll see you guys next time on Crane Train. Stay tuned, like, share, and subscribe.